I've been wanting to say that like all week. Also, it's been a little bit since I sat down and just talked about clothes. So here we are. I did a poll once again. I asked if you wanted to see my spring summer fashion wish list. 21 of you this time. The answers were yes we want it or yes we need it. So you didn't really have a choice. You still voted yes. And so what the people want I will provide. I've been doing some meticulous planning. I've been really diving into the world of spring and summer partly to escape the drudgery, depression, darkness of the winter. So I have a very comprehensive organization of the things that I'm going to be looking to mainly thrift. There's a couple things on here that are like specifically I want to buy them, but we have everything. Hair, nails, shoes, everything. This spring and summer is going to be a big glow up. I just feel it coming. I feel a revamp. First, let's start with shoes. Right off the bat, I've been looking at these for a few months. I think I'm I'm probably going to buy these. I don't know what about them is so cute. They're by Hoka, which is interesting. I seriously, I don't know what about this. Like it looks like I'm about to like hike and I just love them. I really struggle with shoes in the summer. I'm not a big sandal girl. I feel like I have big feet. Sometimes a sandal doesn't do it for me. I like the idea of a sandal. I like a sandal on other people and then I put a sandal on and I'm like Oof. I picked out some other shoes. These Nikes that have silver detailing and like a cool mesh type material around the outside. I love the silver. The other tennis shoes. These are Solomon's. These are a little bit different. They're like a little bit chunkier. I really love the color. The green slash almost yellow vibe is really cute. I almost kind of like these more than the Nike ones. If I had to choose between two of them, I think I would get these green ones. The only thing about colored tennis shoes that I struggle with, I love a colored tennis shoe and then I get the color tennis shoe and I'm like this only goes with three things that I have in my whole closet so and then these cute asics like a little black tennis shoe moment black tennis shoes make me feel like I'm working at a restaurant job again but these are in a good way I mean I've had like black converse but I've never had a fully black tennis shoe and something about these I was like oh these are cute especially if you have them like an all black fit I've never Ooh, actually now that I'm picturing that now let's talk about bikinis it is a triangle string bikini summer it has been and it will continue to be i have this one picked out i think this is like leopard leopard print i love the red and the little ruffling around the edges this little ring in the center is such a cute detail i also picked out this one which is like another olive green and it has stripes we know I love stripes. I will buy anything and everything in stripes. And I love the little, I don't even know what you would call that, the little beads at the top here. I love a string bikini with like small little details like that. Like the other one had that little circle. These have the little, just like elevates it because obviously it is just two pieces of fabric with a string. That reminds me, I saw a TikTok the other day and this girl made her own bikini. And I was like, why have I never thought of that? But she gave the whole pattern, the materials you need, how to sew everything. And I think I'm gonna make my own bikinis. Cause bikinis are expensive, like a hundred bucks for a bikini. I'm like, I could really make this. So these are gonna be my inspo for when I make my own bikinis. Cool. Next, I think my vibe when I'm looking, oh, hello. When I'm looking across all these pictures, there's a very athletic vibe mixed with like a little boy vibe mixed with beachy tube top. Yeah, that's exactly it. So I had a very basic fall winter in terms of like styles and colors. I kept it very minimal and I want to continue this into the spring and summer because it was very easy. Starting off with this girl. It's super basic, plain, simple summer pieces like this. Plain white t-shirt, obviously. Only thing about me in plain white t-shirts though is I sweat like a pig. And so white t-shirt lasts me a week. I'm not even kidding. I need to figure that out. Oh well. Anyways, next we have a darker version almost. Some plain like little sweat shorts, t-shirt, headband, little bag. Very basic, very effortless, cozy, comfy. Then going more into like a little bit more athletic type vibe. Basic white tank top and then some athletic shorts. And then she has like a full beat in her hair done. That is the vibe. And then this girl, I love her crossbody bag. I love the colors of this one though because I feel like the last ones I showed have all been very white, black, neutral. The red with the black bag. 
I also like the fit of her tank top. I like how it's like a high neck. Then to kind of up it a little bit. This is cute with like the jean jacket moment. I feel like this dresses it up almost in a way. There's something interesting about this. I would never think to put a jean jacket with athletic shorts. Something that I don't like though is the ballet flat. Not that I don't like the trend. It reminds me of Tom's in like 2010. If you think about it, Tom's and ballet flats have a very similar energy. I wanted to like Tom's so bad. I tried them on multiple times. Tom's just did not look right on me. I don't know, but what I am loving is a little baby tee with a little skirt and then a little heel. I love the heels that she has on in this. I also love the colors, like the red, yellow, white. Look very nice together. This is a type of ballet heel I could do, I think, because it's square-toed and I think the heel adds kind of like messes with the illusion of like where our foot's just like this and it's like that it looks smaller why am i so obsessed with like my foot size right now i don't know but next i saved this one because i feel like i already have everything that she's wearing i almost have like an identical pair of those shorts and what i liked about it was the skinny little flip-flops it was giving me like 2009 rainbow flip-flop yeah i think this is the vibe for the spring and summer just a flip-flop like let's bring back flip flops it's great same vibe in this picture although this is more of a spring outfit because it's long sleeve and jeans but look at the little flip-flop i don't know why that's just adding so much to this outfit for me it's amazing okay next we have some more monochrome i saved a lot of tube tops and i haven't been in a tube top time since like 2017 so i was like this is an interesting trend Suddenly I could see a lot going down with a black tube top. I love, love, love this outfit that she has on with the little mini black shorts. It almost looks like a one piece, but it's not. It's simple, a small little necklace and a shoulder bag. Not a lot going on. She looks very sleek. Same thing with this girl. I think I saved this also for like the little dainty necklace. I liked her hairstyle too. And then here we have another tube top, which is knit. But I love this one too. It's blue, so beachy. And she has on a very big like statement necklace and a pretty like larger sized bag. The bangles, I'm like, wow, I need to get some bangles. Bangles in the summer with a tube top? Hello? Yeah love that what's next again with the monochrome all white i love how she has like a little bit of black on the hat black on the belt black on the shoes and then the bag is like a really nice olive green i'm really liking olive green i'm noticing i also would love a good hat i've been looking for just a good hat but i'm not sure what color to get because i don't want like five hats i just want one hat that i can put on with everything so maybe a white hat is the way to go i also love this again with the monochrome i'm telling you you're gonna see me this summer two colors black and white <laughs> I love the fit of these jorts. They're fitted but baggy at the same time. I need to be very careful about the jorts that I buy. I'm going to get probably two or three pairs. I especially love that it is a monochrome fit but that the jorts have that decal on the front. It adds something. I think that's all for the outfits. Let's talk about hair, makeup, nails. I love to play with these things a lot more in the summer than I feel like I do in the winter. Same thing with nails. Like summer nails go crazy. So for hair... Sorry, my throat was getting dry. Don't quote me on this, but I'm loving a very warm toned brown. My hair is getting progressively darker and darker. People keep asking me, oh my God, did you dye your hair? And I'm like, no. And then another person asked me and they were like, is your hair naturally that dark? And I was like, what? Like I literally used to have like a medium brown hair, but it is very dark now. I think I want to like warm it up a little for the summer. These are some of the hair vibes. They are different but similar. Wow, I saved this one picture three times, so maybe I really like that. I'm thinking it's like a warm brown summer. I would even go so far as to say it is a golden blonde summer, like a very caramel blonde. I would love to do that. I'm just traumatized from going blonde. It just takes so much time and money and effort. I don't know if I'm quite up for that challenge. Challenge. I think I'm gonna settle for a nice warm brown nails nails are short short nails this summer not as short as these nubs a short manicure with a lot of detail something like this is really cute not a lot of color but a little detail on each little nail I love that I also love this because it almost looks clear I think this is like that gel polish where they use the little magnet love that same thing with this little sage green moment they almost look see-through Oh, these are adorable too. Look at that. I love the green, pink, a little bit of yellow. Those are gorgeous. I thought these are really fun too. The little strawberries. That's so summer. Oh, these are a little bit longer. I do love these. If I could keep those all the time, I think that would be my favorite one. 
so yeah that's my blueprint my plan shout out to all the pinterest girlies who these pictures are from love you let's see how many more days are left till spring how many days left till spring <gasps> 11 days 11 days we will survive we will make it we will persevere okay bye love you